Hey guys, Brandon and Laura here. Tonight we are going to drive downtown Cincinnati and show you guys where Taylor Swift is playing tomorrow night and Saturday night along with her merchandise truck. So let's go check it out. Here's the tunnel. downtown Cincinnati and luckily right now it's not raining beautiful downtown we are currently passing Great American Ballpark and Taylor is playing at Paycor Stadium formerly known as Paul Brown Stadium Turning left on a walnut right now. You know what? I should have gone up one or two streets and then turned. But we'll see where we can get over here. The building across the street, diagonal to the right, is the Underground Railroad Museum. We go right, right here. I think. Yeah. There's a lot of cars down here for... The stadium's all lit up, too. Yeah. So there's Paycor Stadium. That is where Taylor Swift is playing. Now the Andrew J. Brady Music Center is right over there to the... Why are these people standing in the middle of the road? We should be able to go left right here, right? Nope. Well, there's Taylor Swift's uh, merch. There's a merch truck right there. And they got the stadium blocked off right there. Ticketed guests beyond this point. So there it is. We're going to try to swing back around and see if we can, uh, I don't know, can we go right right here? Yeah, we're going to go right and see if we can swing back around and see her merch truck. And there it is. That is Taylor Swift's merchandise truck straight ahead to the right. And apparently they had a huge, huge line today. We saw a video where a guy on the news said he took off work and he went down here with a blanket over his head and sunglasses so his boss wouldn't recognize him. But there it is right there. It looks like this city is ready. There's even people hanging out on the streets late at night. And everybody's ready. We're going to go right down here near uh, Great American Ballpark, near the banks. See what this area is like. 
looks like they got the banks area closed off for tomorrow, I'm guessing. But this place is going to be slamming tomorrow. We heard every hotel room and parking lot has been sold out for a while here. go drive down one of the streets of downtown real quick as you can see that's great american ballpark to our right diagonally and the cincinnati reds hall of fame and museum and they are playing saturday night also i think yeah the reds have been on an absolute terror i believe they have the longest win streak in all of baseball right now their game is sold out Saturday, I think, and maybe tomorrow night. I, wonder who I think they're playing here tomorrow night. I wonder who they're playing this weekend. I'm not sure, but they keep on pulling out victories left and right. Yeah, downtown Cincinnati. streetcars goes underneath us is an old subway system that's abandoned that they never finished long long time ago look there's that's uh us 22 and state route 3 which is also known as montgomery road We're going to go down here and then turn around. That bar right there is still open. Looks like. But yeah, downtown Cincinnati is going to be slammed tomorrow. ticket in town. Gosh, there's still people out, isn't there? There's the big Kroger building to our left over there. We are on Central Parkway. Yeah, that subway should be right underneath us.
they've really, really cleaned over the Rhine up over the last two decades. see the street name right here. This is US 42 further north, it's Reading Road. all weekend long. Mm I think this is the street where Fountain Square is. Netherland Plaza, there's the Crew Tower to our left. Duke Energy Center Convention Center should be right down there to our right. Taylor Swift's merchandise booth right next to the Andrew J. Brady Music Center that has the green lights. Once again, Paycor Stadium. And that is where she's playing. Yeah, that place is going to be the hottest ticket in the world tomorrow, apparently. And what we heard is tickets are going for thousands of dollars. We actually looked online and the cheapest seat we could find, and this was as a few days ago, they've probably gone up, but cheapest ticket we could find in the nosebleeds was north of $2,000. Those tickets might be from resellers too, you know. And I'm 
I'm sure parking tomorrow is going to be ridiculous. Now some of the, these other parking garages down here along US 52, there's a suspension bridge over there. But these other parking garages underneath the stadiums and like there's one right to the left, CRG parking. I'm sure they're going to make a killing tomorrow. There's another CRG. They seem to be the dominant uh, parking company down here. Heritage Bank Center, formerly known as uh, U.S. Bank Arena. Newport Aquarium right across the river to our right. At Newport on the levee. Place to our right. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much it. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, share. Be a huge help to the channel. We appreciate you all very much, and we will see you on the next one.